Superstar. Okay. Hello, welcome back to another uh, Dragon the Sorcerer's Gameplay Parts 96. I'm Robot GZ. Last time I continued the Sorcerer story by doing a lot of dungeons and talking to some NPCs uh, and watching a few cutscenes. So let's continue. So, yeah, there's a, a new uh, intro thing when you. Uh, start up Dragoness. Um, I'm, I'm guessing it's for the newest character. So. Spiritual pets, glitter out. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. No, no. I guess I guess I'm not. I'm just all right. Uh, all right. Uh, turns out, yes. All right then. 
That was weird. Guess I'm doing that dungeon all over again. Oh, fun. So I'm not supposed to sprint down to hell? Alright. If you go through here, we from going to slow down. You scared of showing. Oh, hell. Gosh darn it. Fuck country music. Soon about my tractor, my dog. Soon about getting. Drug. No. So that that was the that was the second glitch I found. Interesting. Put a sign that says walk, don't run when you're going to hell. This is one of those like, <laughs> uh, you know, yo, know, caution signs. You know, like, don't, oh, don't, don't run or you'll slip and crack your head.
You're here. Please tell me about the truth now. What is it? She takes a deep breath and begins. Goddess Altea's Legendia and Goddess Fastenal's Mistland. Though these two worlds are opposite of each other in every way. If one light is if one is light, the other is darkness. If one is a star, the other is shadow, a shadow. Goddess Altea created this beautiful land on all on her own. But she was poisoned to a deep sleep by Vesno, who envied her world. And Goddess Altea's dream started to cloud over this world. Goddess Altea's dream had become her world. What keeps the gods connected with this world is the monolith. It is the bridge that links the, the dream and the medium that helps the gods remember that this world exists. The monolith is also where the door to the Mistland lies. Before Goddess Altea was poisoned, she visited the Mistland too. But the monolith won't open unless it's opened by the one who created it. It has to be opened by the Goddess. But the world will not be destroyed in an instant right after it is opened. The world will take it as a sign. A sign? A sign that it, this world is ready to be destroyed. The, mo uh, the, the moment the door of the monolith, the medium that connects us with the goddess, is opened, we will lose connection with the goddess and the world will so slowly dis disintegrate. Disintegrate? It will disappear without a trace after being sucked into the monolith little by little and become the darkness and chaos itself. As the world becomes a part of the misland, we will disappear. <gasps> the end will not be friendly enough to give us an instant destruction. Everything will disappear slowly in chaos and despair. There must be something that is disappearing at this very moment too. It may be something that we know, or someone we never met before. It could be someone you love, someone as uh, something precious, or what keeps this world beautiful. It can't be, it, it can't even be called death. We may be torn into pieces or mutated into a horrific monster, but we will, we will disappear without a trace of our own selves. We will not be able to recognize ourselves any, anymore. What? I'll just disappear? Dreams will no longer exist when you wake up from them. It will only remain as a vague memory of the one who dreamed it. Our world is also a dream. So that's what will happen to us too. How can that be? Is there any way we can fight it? Mirandello smiles softly. He asked me the same question, but I couldn't answer him. We can close the monolith, but who can do that? Though Fair has conquered every land of this world, he is powerless to stop the monolith. He must have found it hard to accept the fact that he couldn't do anything. But is that the only way? I can't imagine th that the world is going to disappear. We are just a dream to the goddess. It's like we're not real. Like how the goddess is viewed in our world. How can you say that so calmly? Miranda frowns. Right, he said that too. The only way he, the only way we would be to close the monolith. But, but there's no way who can possibly do it. No one, not no way. The agents had to sacrifice their lives to close it, and they even had the help from the Silver Dragon who among us can make a sacrifice that is as powerful as the ancients? Robot TZ, as you have witnessed, all the powerful ancients are now dead. There's nothing we can do more. Um, uh, I'm sorry to tell you this, but there's there's a freaking cult of them. So, no, no, they're not dead. There's like five of them. 
Uh, well, no, wait, six. Never mind. Besides, the goddess has not chased the fragment of this snow away from her dream. Maybe she wishes to destroy this world, too. If that is Telesia, why doesn't the goddess just give up on this sad dream? I understand why Federer is so upset, but I wanted him to remain unchanged as the king of all, of all the humans. I hoped he would lead us to the right path in all the chaos and fear, and accept the ending with dig dignity. Ah, uh, I had forgotten that he is still a human. I, my Telesia has made me a foolish decision to tell him. Mirinda. Well, if you're from the future, doesn't that mean that we have succeeded in closing the monolith? Yes, the world is still exists in the future, but uh, I'm from the future, but I stand here now. So that means the door was closed. I've seen the door with my own eyes, too. Twice! No, wait, three times. Yeah. Mirindale's eyes widen. Really? The door is really closed? How? I don't know, but the fact that I've, I'm alive proves that it's closed. Please, trust me. I'm not a fan or a vision. Please don't give up. This world can't disappear. Miriam Little stares for a while and reaches out her hand. Um, hold Miriam Little's hands. Uh, I can feel your heart beating. You, re you really are alive. So, will you really close the door? Tell us it gave me much knowledge, but it has not taught me how to close the monolith. Ah, now I see. I was mistaken. My Telesia must have brought me to you so that I can have hope. I was the one who lost hope and despair. Yes, I won't give up. I'm ashamed to have shown my weak side to someone who might be my descendant. She blushes uh, a little. Thank you, Robot GC. Miranda bows to show her sincere gratitude. Um, you're welcome, Miranda. Now there's no time to waste. I should find Fetter and come up with a plan. Robot GC, won't you help us too? Sure. Uh, huh? Robot GC? Miranda looks flustered. You're, you're fading away. No, I've been stabbed. <laughs> what? All the part of us. Uh, okay. Is it time to say goodbye? Ah, I'm just very mad. But uh, the fact that you came from that that will give him hope. I will make sure. Goodbye, my adventurer. Bye. I'll be somewhere else. She's gone. Where's Nerido? I promised to help her. When I, uh, when did I end up this time? The only thing that's different is that Mirindale's gone. The others are still the same. You don't know that. <laughs> All I can do is stare, is to stare even when I know the truth. What's the use of witnessing all of this when I can't do anything? I'm just thrown here and there in different, different time periods. I couldn't change anything. Could I have gone mad because of the mollusk? I'm sick of getting swept into another time period now. If I knew that things would become so serious, uh, I feel so dejected. dejected. I should go outside instead of feeling sorry for myself. Graham, you mean which worse than the orchestra debtors? What? I will claim compensation for all the emotion distress, uh, emotional distress. I should get out first. There's no one here anymore. Why do I feel like playing StarCraft? Yeah. <laughs>
Maybe it's good. Uh, maybe it's because it's been like a long, long while since I've played it. Going to do something. Oh, oh. Graham, the camera just showed me where Graham was. I'm like, oh, okay. Gee, you wonder where I should go next. Trust in your fate. You're back. Graham. One who will hold up the fate of this world. You don't sound happy to see me. So you have finally witnessed everything. I'm not sure yet. Graham, just what do you want from me? Why is this destiny? Why? I am only fulfilling my duties. Our meeting was foretold in a dream, so I guided you. I believe you are our savior. I also watched Inception, so you can... Uh, you can... You, you get the basis of the thing that I'm trying to get you through. A dream was in a dream within a dream. In order to get out of the dream, you gotta, you gotta shoot yourself. But it also hurts. A savior. I saved no one. What's the use if I couldn't do anything? What happened to Argenta? History has yet to reach that point. What's that, what does that, does that mean? You don't know? What, can I, uh, what I can tell you for sure is that the door opened twice and closed twice as you have seen for yourself. Okay. The first to close the door was the seal stone, created from the sacrifice of the ancient combined with the silver dragon's power. The second was a human who had who has overcome by being a human, the strong king who can kill anyone, including himself, for what he believes in. How could the door open for the second time when the seal stone was still intact? How come Argenta was around at that time? The seal stone always seals doors from Legendia. It does not bother. It, it does not bother. It is closed from Mistland. If Fessner's creation reaches out to the open of the monolith, the seal stone wouldn't be able to stop that. Because the seal stone was made, uh, made solely for God's Arteus fragments. What the seal stone does is to prevent anyone from this world from opening the monolith. And notifying the owner when the door is, uh, is open. What? Like, you just, like, you get. Uh, whenever the door opens, you just get a notification on your phone. Like, Boop! Oh, the door's open. There. I don't know. I don't know about uh, what. What are? What are iPhones? What is an Android? This is a magical world. I don't know of such things. <laughs> Anyways, I don't know about the Silver Dragon. I kind of streams do not show everything about her. What? I can show you the story of the ones who closed the door the second time if you if you wish. But it's up to you whether you want to see it. 
This memory is not necessarily included in the twisted history of destiny. Although, uh, <laughs> to be fair, there are there are amounts where there are, there are amounts where you can have a a, 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 a literal car as a mount. So uh, it could be possible to have phones in this game? Question mark. Uh, I know this has been hard for you, Anon, on you. You must be tormented by many memories, so I'm no in I'm in no position to force you to see this. This is the last memory you will see if you choose to view. I will I will go. I have to find out what happened at the end. All right, please go to the pain heart now. You will meet them, and. And? Never mind. Please go and uh, be on your way now. Go to the praying heart. You know, proceed to the party. Okay.
was supposed to kill him. Me spewing fire and rain. I spent all fire. <laughs> is nothing but a dream since God is that and I have forgotten about that. She regards us as mere mi mirages, like how we view our, our own dreams. Fetter. But I exist here. Same for all the other lives in this world. It may be a mere dream to the goddess, but this is reality for us. That was the truth I have been holding on to all the, these years. I heard the screams of those who suddenly lost their loved ones. This world is turning into chaos. Soon, the time of endless fear and anguish will come. So this is what I've been striving for all these years. This world I've strived to conquer has less substance than the shadows. The, the goddess created us merely to taunt us with the futility of our own existence. No, Fader. It's not like that. We're blessed by the guys. No matter what's happening now, that hasn't changed. She's bestowed upon us her blessing, has she? It is her blessing that we should turn to ash. She can keep her blessing. I want no part of it. And what part of it will we learn about? Tune in next time to... Dragon the Sorcerer's Escape Pipe Heart 97. This is Roger Easy sign off. Bye.